So now if you've actually seen a little bit about alcohol or you've seen maybe some of the test videos we've thrown up or maybe you've heard about it or seen something about it on Facebook, you're thinking this is kind of dumb. But it's not. It's really fun. And it doesn't probably translate really well even in video form to the internet, but it really is a good time. And as silly as the game sounds, when you get in there, you take it a little seriously. For the first time recently, we had a three-on-three -three game, and that was absolutely incredible, although everybody did notice the physicality of the game jumped way up. But this story is not about what happened when we played threes. This story is about last weekend, and about the smallest, oldest, heaviest player, that would be me, taking on the league's juggernaut, and it's six foot four giant uh, Matt Izzy Isertel O'Long Johnson for those in the know um, so there's a scramble situation and those are when alcohol ball gets really crazy we're only playing two on two so the pool is not overloaded with people the ball really starts to just squib around at this point we have the goal set up on the deck so facing to the south and I get kind of pushed off and Matt uh, to the left towards the patio Matt makes a dive for the ball and doesn't get it and it sort of squibs to the very back line and at some point Aaron and Gary are fighting for it too but they sort of locked up somewhat near the back corner so that it's really in this moment that Matt grabs the ball again right in the check zone and I'm off to his right perpendicular and we both stare at the goal so we take off for the goal which is hard enough in water but we both have a lot of momentum built up. And there comes this moment where we're just two missiles on an intercept course. I'm on defense, and that's probably not going to happen since Matt can easily throw the ball over, around, or through me. But I'm game, so I give it a shot. Even better, there's a moment right as we scream at each other, we both d dunk ourselves to our shoulders and crouch down, preparing to full-out launch like a dolphin into the air. Again, Matt's got me killed on this, but I give it a go. So, we leap into the air, eyes lock, I just go to whack his arm, and I don't know what happened. I've never really laid out. I don't like going underwater. Matt flops around like a dolphin all the time. It's part of why he's awesome. But this one time, I went for it as hard as I could. And I thought I clipped his arm, but then I heard that whoonk when he ridiculously fastballs the play ball like through the backstop of the goal. And I was like, damn it, he scored. A second later, I hear the cat calls of, Whoa! From both Aaron and Gary. And Matt's got this look on his face like, You gotta be shitting me. And it's then in that split second that I realized I did hit his arm and I knocked the ball loose and he never got his shot on the goal. Yes, in this one titanic moment of two of the captains of the sport, one guy completely overmatched just once, the old heavy set little guy, totally got and slew the demon. So... That's my alcohol ball story of pride, and hopefully you enjoyed this video.